Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do your uh, end of March love, a little quick little love reading. Um, I'm going to pull three cards and then we'll look at the card at the bottom of the deck for love. What are the messages for Pisces for love? Messages for love for Pisces. Messages for love for Pisces. Three cards forever. Love for Pisces. All right. Nine of Cups. Nice. Wish fulfillment. Um, just feeling emotionally balanced, emotionally happy, happiness here. The Hierophant, maybe because something is going your way, something traditional, maybe a marriage, maybe uh, the judgment, uh, not judgment, the justice system, the penal system. Uh, the bottom of the deck, Knight of Cups, nice. And then the Three of Wands. Mm, I, why did I just get this? Okay, somebody's getting their wish fulfilled to walk away from a marriage. Knight of Cups could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Eight of Wands. This could be happen, happening quickly. Uh, you could be having rapid communication in regards to the trouble in your relationship. Uh, you might have been with a very dominant person, or this could be you. Pisces just getting back in control of things. The Wheel of Fortune. Every reading had the Wheel of Fortune. This is the third month, though. This is divinity. This is the divine intervening. This is the Wheel of Fortune. What you've dealt out uh, karmically is coming back to you. Hopefully, it's good. Uh, but the Wheel is turning. It's turning in your favor. Five of Swords. You might have to defend yourself verbally. You might have to do that verbal sparring. Not something that you want to do, but sometimes you just have you're dealing you might be dealing with the immature air sign gemini libra aquarius definitely an air sign knight of swords they they just want to come in they could be spying on you they they want to come in and give their truth about a situation but it looks like um maybe for them and for you six of swords you guys are just going to move away from the turbulence the drama um into a more peaceful state i guess after you you both speak your peace there could be some solidarity coming in for your new foundational start, either with someone in relationship, or this could be business. This could be pretty much anything. Um, you might weigh up the options of this with the Two of Pentacles, your pros and your cons. Wow, then the Ten of Pentacles. Whatever this is, maybe it's a large sum of money. Maybe it is marriage or engagement to someone who does have money or is very solid. Uh, Ten of Pentacles, this takes you to some really solid energy, really stable energy, some uh, legacy type energy. Um, Two of Wands, you got a decision to make and you're actively making it. Page of Wands, there's that message, that conditional message. You better do such and such or you fill in the blank. That's that message of action. Uh, nine, of pen nine of Pentacles, maybe all these Pentacles take you to a, a very healthy um financial state it balances it balances you out you could be dealing with a sagittarius but there could be still some mental anguish maybe due to this third party situation that you're either in or were in could be dealing with the capricorn here uh or just a toxic situation in the past indecision here needing to make a decision messages of stability are around you and they surround you but you're, you're emotionally confused maybe about uh, gemini libra aquarius this is my libra aquarius card maybe because they want to have a resurgence of love but they may also have someone else uh you don't want this but this situation involves children what did i say you didn't want it for because you're not taken to this opportunity you don't even view it as opportunity it looks like your, your wish fulfillment is to walk away from uh, a long-standing relationship and or a marriage um, and just worry about self because it looks like some really good things are coming in for you. All right, so if this resonated with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Uh, follow me on Instagram, Instago. Uh, choose to fund the page by clicking the GoFundMe link. Uh, send me an email if you want to request a personal reading. Remember, Pisces, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you guys. Pray for me as well. I'll see you in April. Take care.